Yo, 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 yo. What's up, what's up, what's up? Going to continue the series or games of Gensei Rabbit. Uh, just their vision. So you got Gensei on the Terran. You got Lovely Rabbit on the Protoss, Protoss Terran. Don't know what they're up against. So I'm guessing Gensei is going to go for the triple barracks. He's going to go with the barracks on eight. So he goes for the barracks first. And his partner's really close. Going to get that gateway. Here's your depot on nine. And then this guy's going to go mine, I think after. Then this next guy, next SCV, he might actually pull this SCV, yeah. He's going to pull the SCV to make another barracks. He's going to wall this off. Partner already scouting. Let's see they're up against a Zerg. And the Zerg is going for Zerglings. Depot finishes, and he uses that to... He's going to build a... He uses that guy to scout. And he's going to use this guy gonna use this guy to make a barracks he's trying to make it oh he's actually gonna go so he's gonna scout this out here gonna see he's getting blocked in walled in there's your forge he's got two barracks he's gonna go right into a quick gas he's got one marine he's got the bunker and let's see if rabbit goes for rabbits boxed in as well right now so Gonna scout the Zerg out right here. And we'll see if Gensei goes into maybe quick a quick academy. Here's your overlord. Gonna be protecting the minerals. Gonna get a gas really soon, I'm sure. So yeah, they're playing a little bit defensive. He's got these guys. Is this uh there's your academy? Gonna see if he's getting uh, cannon rushed. Here's your overlord, gonna be annoying with that. Gonna send out the probe and start taking this out, I think. So he's gonna build a pylon right here. And we'll see if Gensei goes into a factory or if he just goes into another barracks. I think he'll probably go into another barracks. Nope, gonna go into a factory, so. Shows how much I know on their strategy. So, here's a cannon coming down. Gonna deter that overlord. Gonna put a couple cannons right here. Gonna micro these guys back and forth. There's two cannons right here that they see. And trying to get these cannons up. So, doing a nice job right there. He's got the marines right here. There's a cannon right there. And he's getting stim. Needs to make sure he protects this cannon. And doesn't really matter if he runs these Zerglings past because he's got a cannon at, at home. And going to kill that Overlord. So that's a big loss for Jose right there. Factory should be almost done. Pumping two medics. Here's your Zerglings. And these cannons are finished. So this will get taken out. And... Looks like maybe a command center is going to come down for Gensei. We'll see. We go into a starport and another barracks. Stim almost done. And here's a Zergling going to get a scout off. Two Zerglings in here. Three Zerglings. Going to build a robo right here. I like that move. Here's your engineering bay. We'll see if he gets range. Doesn't really have the gas. He's got siege. And we see a little attack right here from Rabbit. Gonna start busting that out. And is he just gonna run past? I don't know if this is the best move. He's actually gonna go straight for the attack on the Zerg. Maybe take out some drones if he can. Gonna see four macro hatcheries. Gas getting made. Here's your tank on the way. Almost done. Gonna micro that a little bit. And a couple cannons getting a little bit closer. I don't think he got range. Here's your Hydro's done. 
And just gonna continue to pump. Here's your tank. Gonna start moving on out. And nice little chamber there by Jose. Gonna take out this cannon. And he's got another medic on the way, getting range now. No bunkers or anything. And he might just put a tank right here and take this out. I don't know if that can hit that range over there, though. And now we're going to see an attack on Rabbit right here. But with these cannons, you got two Reavers on the way. Let's see if he's got, he's got three more Zelts that are going to pop out. Might send a tank over here to help up with this. It might go down. It looks like it is going to go down. Slowly moving on out here, getting a drop ship, I think. Getting a vessel. And here's some Hydras coming in here. Going to go for the attack. This is a fun game right here. But I think Gensei is going to see the opportunity to bust out right here. Going to stim up. And we'll see if he just goes for the attack on... Might just go for the attack on the Protoss. So he's busting out pretty nicely. He's going to have the vessel. He's got five barracks. A lot of cannons coming down speed. Zealots are huge. Hydra's in here, gonna stack attack. A lot of cannons coming down. I think Rabbit's gonna be okay. And he's got... Ooh, these all went down, unpowered. So that was huge. And now we're gonna see the attack on the Zerg, it looks like. A couple uh, pylons coming down. All this is unpowered. So Gensei just going to go around and go right after the Zerg. Yeah, I never did these games. These games were all pretty good, actually. And sieging these guys up. Here's your vessel in here. And he's going to kill the Zerg, so it's going to be teammate for teammate. He's got to D up a little bit. Getting that upgrade. There's your command center. And he's got the vessel in here. I'm guessing he's going to get a comm set right away. Let's see if a counter comes on Gensei. But somehow Rabbit's still alive here. They had to pull all their units. And now it's Gensei. Versus Dingo's Protoss. And here's your comp set. Here's another command center coming down. I'm surprised. Gensei's not even getting really much defense up here. He's got two factories. He's got another vessel on the way. Jose was eliminated. And now it's a 1v1. We'll see if he scans as soon as this finishes. I have a feeling he wants to scan maybe about right here. There's his attack going on Dingo. And there's probably gonna be a bunch of cannons, yeah. Only four here, so he should be able to bust through this. He's got all these units here as well. Gonna kind of defensive matrix this guy, run this guy through. Let that guy take all the hits. Gonna take out the pylon like a beast. So darn good. Here's your vessel in here. There's the GG. Let's just take a look at Dingo's base. Yeah, I mean. Yeah, that was a good, good game right there. Fun stuff. Try to turn that off as soon as possible. So we're going to have Gensei and Rabbit both on the Protoss. He's 
These games have been pretty close, actually. Closer than I thought. And they're going to see a choke Zerg. And going to go right into a forge. And he's going to pull four probes out. What is he going for? Is it lagging? Or did I hit? Oh, I hit it too slow, too fast. So he's got these guys coming on out. And gonna try to take out this choke. He's got one gateway. He's gonna have six probes right here. Plus, we're gonna have we're gonna see a bunch of zealots. Here's your forge. And he's actually gonna go right into the base of Jose. And Went on the minerals and then he spread for the attack. And just gonna micro this like crazy. Gonna put a cannon down for safety purposes. And now I'm gonna send these guys on up. There is a creep county on the way, but that's gonna go down quickly. I think Rabbit will get a Nexus. Here's a probe scouting that cannon's gonna finish. Sell it coming on down. Couple zerglings. And this is how you take care of a choke zerg for the most part. Here's a zealot coming in. Gonna send these probes back home. I think he's gonna keep this one guy and just distract. Get him in the way. Make sure no creep colony comes down. Second cannon coming down. See if gas gets made by Gensa. Usually they get gas about three minutes. Already has gas, yeah, so 230 for Rabbit. And this choke is gonna go down. No cannon here, so this counter might do some work against Rabbit. And right now they're just sending all their units here. They'll put down a pylon. We'll see a stack attack come. But Rabbit doesn't really even notice this right now. I have to cancel that uh, cannon. Sending a couple of these zealots on back. Got this attack down here. Trying to keep this choke alive. Choke for Dingo. Spreading these guys. And when your opponent is choked up like this, you know that they don't have that many gateways. So they're, they're not going to have a huge, huge force. Here's your cyber. And... Yeah, that hatchery went down. This is going to go down. And you might, they might just run these guys past. We'll see. But the tech is just going to be too much. In my opinion. From Gensei and Rabbit. There's your Robo. See if a Citadel comes. Looks like another gateway is ready to, to get made. Here's your cannons right here. Sending these guys out and we'll probably see speed get made from Rabbit. He's gonna go with the Citadel. See if he gets that upgrade. Gonna start that upgrade. I mean these guys are like fine-tuned machines like robots we go for the attack on Jose and this might kill Jose can say just gonna put these guys here he wants to kind of scout this out and he's getting his upgrade as well he's probably gonna go with Templar drop so probably send a couple zealots on the side make sure there's no vision we'll see if a dragoon comes down to kill this overlord two more gateways and Jose's not going to be dead just yet, so he lost his choke. And here is your ro uh, robotics getting a shuttle, Citadel getting speed, and then we're going to see the Templar Archives. Actually, a support bay first. And we'll see if a Templar Archives gets made. And here's a scout from Dingo. 
Gonna get a lot of vision right now. Yeah, I'm glad I'm doing these games. These are pretty solid games. Gonna take out this Zealot. Doesn't want this guy to get in there. Close, but no cigar. Shuttle should be popping out. Gonna get a Reaver right after. He's got the money. Is he waiting for 200? There's your Reaver. I mean, just the timing impe impeccable. And Rabbit gonna start cannoning the Zerg. And now it's gonna be kind of like a one versus one. So Gensei is gonna one versus one Dingo. While Rabbit one versus one's the Zerg. Doesn't have a choke. He's getting speed. He's gonna probably get some Dragoons really soon. Couple cannons coming at home. There's another forge. Cannons right here for Rabbit. And probably gonna attack this creep colony. There's some Zerglings getting made by Jose. Here's that, some DTs in here. So nice move right here from Dingo. Going to catch. Can't say off guard. And this cannon's gonna finish. The Reaver's gonna finish. I mean, this game was good attempt right there. Really close. I did not expect that. Nice move there by Dingo, for sure. Had a chance. It would have killed. I think it would have killed Rabbit. He should have sent that into Rabbit's base. Would have killed Rabbit, I think. Wasn't making any more cannons. And going to build some pylons on the side. Here's your observer. Upgrade almost done. I think Rabbits is going to be done. Yeah. Sending some Dragoons on the side. And going to run these guys through. And just going to go for maybe a main hunt or something. Knows that, that Dingo must have a small base here. Oh, he's going to use that with the Reaver drop. Got to go back and pick up the Reaver. Take it out the main. Trying to... Gonna drop the Reaver. Picking it up. He's probably just gonna Reaver Shuttle Micro right here. Spending his money like a beast. This whole time. Some Zerglings out here. DT's inside of Rabbit Space. And Kensei is going to bring that Observer on over. But going to lose the Nexus right here. I think he cancelled it. Yeah, I mean... These games are really, really good, so I don't know if it's, if you guys do like the, the no vision of the other team, it's kind of interesting to see. Here's your drop, Reaver, dropping some Zealots, and he's just going to use this to attack, use this Reaver, go after the main, drops the Reaver, picks it back up. It's at 100. Needs one more hit, and there goes the Reaver. Nicely done. Rabbit gonna start going for the attack on the Zerg. He's got a decent amount of Dragoons here. Pumping up the gateways right now. Gensei gonna start probably pumping up his gateways as well. And we'll see if another Observer gets made. Yeah, there's another one. And they're going to go straight for the attack on Jose. This is why I think these guys... Um, players now can... I think they could compete with these guys. I mean... There's a G. G. McGee. Ski. I know they beat him a lot of times, but this one's a little bit longer. I might have casted this game already. 
I feel like I casted all the longer games. But get rid of that vision. All right, so Rabbit realizing his partner's right here, so he's actually gonna scout this way. Because if he scouts here, then he can't scout another base. Those are the little tricks that you learn. And Gensei's gonna be Protoss this game. Rabbit's gonna be Zerg. Going with the Zerg Lings with the speed. You get the gateway, then you scout. And the scout up. There's another. Gonna go two gateways and a forge. Because they know they're gonna box someone in. And a lot of players on the western scene go for the forge first, but you really don't need to go for the forge first because the forge is finished right now. It takes, let me just pause it. I think that by the time you scout, it takes a good amount of time to get that pylon down. So it's it's almost unnecessary to go pylon forge. It's almost better to go pylon gateway gateway forge. So I think that if you want to try to box in, because then you're gonna have units to help with the boxing. And um Yeah, so let me know what your thoughts are. I think that's a little bit better. Here's your Zerglings. Oh, I'm gonna have four right here. And now they know. I think they scouted everything, so they know that there is a Protoss top right. And this this zealot's pretty early. He's gonna get a cannon at home. Probably gonna put try to box in bottom left. Gonna be annoying with the probe. And they're gonna see they're up against a Protoss. Protoss. So two Protosses. Jose is bottom left. Here's your second hatchery. And doesn't have. Not gonna box in, realizing they're against a Protoss Protoss. Here's two more gateways coming down for Gensei. And no hatchery or no sunken or creep colony for Rabbit right now. So and I'm pretty sure I've not seen this game. Taking out some of these zealots. This is why you get speed zerglings. They're able to snipe out zealots, especially when they're across the map. Here's your attack on Rabbit. See if he puts down some creep colonies. And going to retreat. Oh no, here they are. Gonna micro these guys. Lost one drone. But gonna defend that pretty nicely. Here's your first gas. I mean, they always get gas about 3 minutes, 2 minutes and 45 seconds. And gonna try to start boxing in top right, even though. Yeah, I mean, and now Rabbit's going to start harassing bottom left so they can box in top right. So, but I think Dingo's going to have too many, too many zealots here. And here's your cyber on the way. I'm surprised Dingo didn't go for that attack. I guess he doesn't want to, he's worried. Here's your choke. I think he's worried that he'd get countered with these zerglings right here, so. He's going for a choke, and here is a counter going to happen on Rabbit. Going to have to pull the Zerglings back. He knows that the Zerglings can get there somewhat in time. Might even put a chamber right here. Here's four Zealots coming on in. Here comes your Zerglings. Going to pull these guys to the right side. And got this attack right here. This is going to be a box in. Hatchery all the way over there, not completely sure why. Gonna lose a couple drones, but not too many. And is Dingo gonna be able to bust out of here? The tech is gonna be on point. Ooh, these zealots were just chilling there, so not the best job there by Gensei. We all make mistakes. But he's still gonna get this wall off. And now we might see, I'm guessing there's a choke here. Ooh, not gonna be a choke, so they might go for the attack on bottom left. And 
Here's your hydralis done. Yeah, nice little wall off right here. Gonna try to snipe out some zealots, but there's a lot of cannons. Three cannons at least, a fourth one on the way. And is Gensei going Dragoons? He is going Dragoons. I think Gensei would have been better to go off, go with Reavers, but I think they're going to probably try to box in bottom left as well. And uh, just buy his partner as much time as he can get. More cannons coming down from Gensei right here. They're going to try to go for the attack. Maybe go back door on Jose right here. Here's your attack. We'll see a little micro action. Jose's got to retreat these guys. Got the overlords in the base. And a drop. Coming double reaver from Jose. Got the zerglings on the side. But this is going to be huge. Not going to see it. Pulling the hydras. Gonna get the left side. Gonna pick it up. Takes out one Reaver. And going to be okay. Gonna start taking out this tech. Range is done. Little micro. Gonna take out the cyber. Which he does. Got the zerglings on the side for that scout action. And they're gonna slowly try to dwindle down Jose. He does have reavers though. Nexus, there's your reavers. And let's see if a lair gets made from Rabbit. And no idea what Dingo is really going for. Maybe he's going for drops of his own. Both Rabbit and Gensei are in a pretty tough spot. Looks like a Robo is going to come. Maybe two. There's your Citadel. Going to have to retreat out of there. And I think they're going to have to just start being defensive. Nexus will probably come down for Gensei. A couple hatcheries over here. Getting Burrow. Getting that Lair. Got the Dragoons over here for drops. Gonna put a pylon over there. Yeah, he's got the zerglings right here. I mean, they have the the map pretty well established. Here's your gateways coming down. Another cannon. There's your nexus from Gensei. And Dingo's had a lot of time to kind of build up. There's only one. Oh, there's two cannons here. I'm guessing a drop is gonna be coming from Jose. One thing Jose loves to do is use his reaver. So. Trying to make sure I watch the mini-map. Make sure I see all the drops that happen. And I'm going to have to retreat this guy. See if another couple macro hatches come down for Rabbit. Support by Templar Archives. Got the Dragoons ready. Here's a drop coming and doesn't have speed. Forgot to get speed. And that is not going to be the best drop from Jose, that's for sure. That was a big time loss. I'm going to start putting these guys here, maybe take out a couple gateways. I'm going to continue to make all out Dragoons. Probably going to make some Templars getting. Arbiter Tribunal, here's your attack uh, at the front at the choke. Gonna try to bust through the front. Sending some of these guys over. I think if Dingo went for this attack earlier and then Jose went for the drop on Gensei, that would have been the better option. A couple macro hatches right here. And upgrade finished. Upgrade finished for Dingo. I saw another drop somewhere. These are just shuttles right here. A lot of Dragoons out here. 
Templars. And where's his Stargate at? Oh, right here. He's, he is getting an Arb. So, gonna go with a drop. Here's a drop coming on. Gensei, he's trying to pull the Dragoons on over. And this is gonna sneak in. Pull in the probes. See if he gets a shot off. Gensei's at 51 probes. Here's your attack on Gensei. He does have DTs here. And here's your Lurker. He's gonna go for the attack on Jose. Here's a drop coming right here. Got these guys burrowed up. Templar drop on Gensei. Pretty big base for Rabbit right here. Gonna start moving the probes. Spots that out instantly. Not gonna really lose too many probes. And gonna be fine. And the choke of Jose is gone. Speed for Rabbit. Maybe Gensei will get one more Nexus. Maybe right here or something. Arb is going to be almost done. And going to split these guys up. Get more vision of the map. Here's a drop. Reaver in here. I think that Jose needs to go for a Templar job. Spending too much money on these Reaver drops. Or if you use those Reavers with the attack. Here's your Arbiter. Getting recall upgraded. Here comes a drop from Gensei. Templars in each. One storm, two storms, three storms, four storms. And got a lot of probes right there for sure. Now just look at the vision Rabbit and Gensei have right now. So they're going to see all drops except for drops coming from Jose. Here's your Arb. And gonna start moving on out. There's an observer right there. A lot of units right here. And Rabbit's at 155 supply. Here's another drop from Gensei. 101 upgrades. Here's your attack on Rabbit, getting some lurkers. One upgrade on attack. Here's your observer. Might just snipe out the observer, seeing it right there. Here's your Arb. Lurkers. And this drop is going to try to sneak in here. Going to get sniped out by Dingo pretty nicely. Going to send out some more overlords. Got some DTs in here. Can say spending his money like an absolute beast. 1-1 one, one upgrades for Rabbit. 1-0-1 one, one for Dingo. See if like a major... Reaver drop. This drop's going to sneak in. Two Templars in here. And going to get the storm off. And I think he got all of Jose's minerals. Here's a drop coming. And forgot to get speed. And pulling the probes. Where did that drop go? There it is. Here comes your attack. And look at this. Huge choke right here. So I guess they should be fine. Think we're gonna start building up in the middle though. And look at this drop. It's got a bunch of reavers, I'm guessing. And gonna go after Gensei right here. Gensei does have does he have he might have stasis, which would be huge. It's exactly what he needs. Gonna pull. And here's a massive drop by Jose. Going to take out Gensei. There's your stasis. It's really going to help out, but this main is going to go down. One more hit. There's your next hit. So Gensei going to lose his main right there. Pulling these guys back. Doesn't want to lose his other nexus. There's an Arbin here. Drop coming.
see if this drop lands. Templar. There's your storm. And he stasis his partner's drones. Because I think he saw that he didn't move them. Sometimes that's worse off. And here are all of Gensei's probes. But yeah, now Rabbit really doesn't isn't getting any minerals right now. Almost better to just maybe do one side. And then let the other side die. Lurkers right here are going to be huge. One zero two upgrades for Gensei. They want to kill this right here. And look at all of these hatcheries for Rabbit. So, I mean, he's maxed out. Drop going to try to go in there, but too many cannons. Looks like he's going to go down, right down here and right down the middle. He's going to see this opening. Unless he thinks he can go all the way down here. There's some Corsairs over here. One, two upgrades. Lurkers out here. Where's that observer? It's right there. Oh, it's a DT actually. And Jose is going to choke up. Here's a drop coming. And Rabbit's got a couple Scourgies. He will be able to snipe this out. There's your Scourgies going on over. Drop coming from Gensei. You can snipe out one, but the other one has temp Templars in it. <coughs> Gets the drop off, Jose. Lost a few probes right there. And Gensei's pretty broke. Get a couple more cannons, get some uh, Corsairs. We'll see if Gensei tries to drop Dingo. Two, one, two upgrades. And some Dragoons out here. No upgrades for Jose right now. If you guys like the channel, subscribe, give it a like. Uh, leave a comment, helps the algo. Here's your drop, gonna get spotted out. One shuttle's gonna go down. Another shuttle over here. A lot of cannons coming down. And I think Gensei's realizing that he's been able to drop bottom left pretty good, so why not just cannon in top right? And then we're gonna try to kill bottom left. I think that's what their plan is. Yeah, and I don't, I, I don't think I've ever done this game either. I haven't done any of these games, which is pretty cool. Tried the drop, going to miss. A lot of lurkers here. Maybe Guardians will be coming soon. Here's your Gritter Spire. And Jose really hasn't even tried to drop Rabbit, but Rabbit does have 8K and 4K, so... Can say spending his money like a beast. Jose's kind of broke. This guy's got 2-2 two, two upgrades. Lurkers all over the place. Looks like a big drop's gonna come. Might come on Rabbit. We'll see. Is this an actual drop? No. Some Guardians getting made, I think. Here's a drop from Gensei. Two Templars in here. And Jose gonna get stormed. He lost some of his probes. A decent amount. Guardians are finishing up. Might use the Scourgey and just take that out right there. And they'll start building in the middle. It's a drop. No. Templar drop right here, though. Let's see if there's any Scourgies back at home. He's going to pull the Hydras, but then this drop's going to come. This probably got a bunch of Reavers in it. 
Ooh, stasis comes down. Beautiful job right there by Gensei. But I think that's just a Templar drop. And now, we'll probably see another drop come from Gensei. He's got an Arb over here. There's another drop. And... Ooh, got it just in time. Trying to break out right here. Here's your hatchery. More cannons coming down. Was able to storm a lot of the gas right here. More guardians. There's another drop. And sometimes doing that isn't the best thing for your partner, but his partner's got 11k, so... He realizes it's it's fine. Actually, wouldn't mind probably losing some of his drones. And just so many overlords all over the place. Can use these guardians on the side. Three one three upgrades for Gensei. Some reavers right here. Look at all of these cannons. I mean, completely controlling the map. And then they're going to start pushing the Protoss, I think. But they are going for the attack. Let's see what 2 1 2 upgrades for Dingo. Guardians getting made up here. Got a ton of Guardians right here. Even getting Sunkins all over the place in the middle. And here are your Guardians up front. Probably see another drop come on Jose. He's got an Arb in here. We'll see if maybe he tries to stasis some of the Reavers. I think that would be a good move. Here's another drop. A lot of Reavers in here. And we'll probably see a stasis come down. We accidentally stasis himself. He's got this guy right here who can stasis. But that was a lot of Jose's army, and now they're going to start going for this straight attack on Jose. And these guardians are slowly busting through. Kind of clearing the path. They'll probably move these dragoons on in. There's a DT right here. He needs to bring in an overlord. More gateways coming down for Gensei. Just no way that Dingo is going to be able to bust out of this anytime soon. We'll probably see a, a drop just sneak on in here. There's a bunch of Templars. Unless he's trying to send these guys on over. Actually going to storm those Dragoons right there. More storms coming down. Let me know your thoughts, guys. Do the two versus two players now, have they gotten a little bit better? Could they have a chance? Hydra's right here. Gonna spot out this drop. Let's probably get stasis. There's a bunch of arbs right here. He's pulling it. He's gonna stasis his probes. Double stasis. And bottom left is basically dead. No GG. Dingo might say it because he wants to rematch. Can't say gonna say the out. Get out. So that is going to be that game. These games have been pretty, pretty entertaining. And this is gonna be the last one. See how this one goes. Okay. So you got Rabbit. Got Gensei. I never really see Gensei go for a mech build. I feel like maybe his Vulture Micro isn't as good.
who knows. I mean, it's got to be pretty good. This time he's going to go with the... Oh, okay, there we go. He's going with the mech bow. Proven me wrong. We'll see. Yeah, I mean, he's played in a bunch of three versus threes. And he's had to go on the mech build, so... I think you go the mech build when your partner's really close like this. His partner's Protoss. He knows that he'll be safe. His partner can help him out if he needs it. Scouting all the middle spots. And let me just pause. I think he scouted this spot first because if he scouts here, then uh, they don't know who's here. And they, they definitely want to know if there's someone below them. Because that person can come up and attack Gensei somewhat easy. And then Gensei really doesn't have to make many Marines. So, let's see if he even makes one. Yeah, so I don't think he... Maybe he'll make one. Yeah, just so you can maybe scout, kill a probe or something. But here's your zealot coming on out. Gonna see that the Protoss, they're up against two Protosses. A choke already coming from this Protoss. No choke from top left. Forge coming down. And I think that Rabbit's gonna be a little bit less aggressive. Gonna wait for his partner to get them vultures. And then they can go for the micro. And we're going to see probably a cannon. There's your cannon coming down. Pulling the zealots. Got a zealot right here. Annoying top left a little bit. Trying to get some hits off on this guy. Vulture should be coming. They're on the way. This guy's scouting. Yeah, see, so he just made one marine. Didn't have to waste any more minerals. And gas is probably going to come down. They love to get their gas so early. This guy got zero kills, but he's being annoying. There's a cannon right here. Here's your vultures. And I'm gonna just micro these guys. And he's gonna have two more coming soon. I'm gonna go with the double machine shop. So not too worried about it. Takes out one zealot. Getting tank and mines. Here's another vulture that pops out. And this is just going to be a lost cause. Might get one or two SCVs, but I don't think it's going to be many. These guys are pretty low HP. Going to get these guys in the way and clip them beautifully. Nicely done by Gensei. And now they're going to probably have two tanks on the way. Might send one of these zealots on over to scout the Protoss top left. He lifted up the barracks. And vultures, let's see how close the mines are close. He's just going to start laying the mines right here. And then they know they can start going for the attack slash push on top left. So we'll see some micro action. Mines are going to be done. Going to split three up, three up. There's your mines. And now we're going to see an attack on. Yeah, so I think speed is going to get made. There's your citadel. Probably going to get that upgrade really soon, if not now. Rabbit is. Waiting for those tanks to come on over. Here's your barracks. Let's see if he's getting that upgrade. Still not getting that upgrade. Here's your tank going to siege up and start pushing super fast. Might take this and send it in. And see exactly what does what does he have in his base. Let me get these guys a little bit closer. Take out these tanks. Two more tanks on the way. Another factory gonna get a turret. Might get a turret at home just in case. There's some DTs. But now this is all gone. He's got I think he's got speed already for his vultures. I'm gonna try to take this out, and now they're just gonna go straight for the attack. I'm gonna build some pylons on the side, get that vision. Templar Archives and a Robo. 
Sieging up the tanks. Got the vultures in here. Here's a probe. Ooh, I think there's I think there's DTs in here. DTs are in here. So going to have to retreat out of here. And a lot of cannons coming down. And this is a DT drop. And I'm guessing DTs are going to be getting a lot of Dragoons. He's going to have to pull these guys to the side. But the tanks are rolling in fast. Even though there are DTs over here. And going to go after the probes. Bringing the DTs back. I don't see them though. And a triple Nexus. And Jose is just going to leave. Realizing that he's basically dead. Here's your triple. DT's gonna die over here. This guy's gonna die as well. There's your G G M G Ski. So let's see what the base of Dingo look like. Oh, it's not going to let me. Guess not. But that is how you do it, guys. So good games right there. Give it a like, give it a subscribe, leave a comment. And uh, I will talk to you guys later. I'm hoping to do the SCW series. Uh, looking forward to both ones and twos. So if I can do those live, I definitely will. They need to put some times out there, though. But I will talk to you guys later. Peace.